Hello, this is Ami Diamond. In this episode, I'd like to show you uh, the functionality in OneDrive that you can share with anyone. Uh, we always do that, but uh, I want to show you uh, what the person that receives the link uh, actually sees. So actually, uh, let's create a new folder and let's call it sharing, share. And uh, we'll take it and uh, click on the share button. Now here, if we click on this drop down, we can choose anyone has the link. We can choose if to let them edit, uh, to set the expiry date, to set the password. Let's leave it like that. Let's click apply. So actually we're giving them edit rights and um, all I need to do is actually to copy the link. That means, so I copied it. Now I will go to another uh, user uh, which should not have any access, but now because he has the link, uh, he will. So we see, first of all, uh, I'm now in the environment of Army Diamond. So you see there's an initial one and there's also um, the share. Um, now uh, let's see what actually the user can do. So the user can uh, upload files. Yes, because we, we gave them edit, right? Let's upload this document. Just a second, what's happening? Let's refresh. Ah, here it is. So the document is here, but let's see what he can do. All he can do is open, preview, download, copy. So that means actually that he cannot delete. Even though he has edit rights, he cannot delete. He cannot also uh, open and uh, create here uh, a Word, Excel, or PowerPoint. Uh, what he can do is to download it and to copy it. Let's see where he can copy it. Uh, he shouldn't have any place to copy it. Uh, okay, because uh, this user is actually in the 365, then he can copy it to his own uh, OneDrive or to his other. Um, but let's just uh, take this link maybe and uh, put it in a new browser, which is, he doesn't have a 365 account. Uh, let's see. Okay, so actually, uh, let's see what happens if he wants to move a copy. Aha, uh -huh. so uh, uh, again, this is a, a user that actually has access. Let's just go to a, another one. Let's totally create a new private mode. Okay, so um, the f so what I want to say is actually that um, these are the functionalities he can do. Uh, if we compare to what uh, a regular user can do, uh, look, he can share, copy, uh, rename, he can uh, delete, he can manage access, he can do some automations, and uh, maybe even convert to a PDF. Uh, okay, so this is what I wanted to show you. See you and goodbye.